Welcome to the support video of Workload Automation video series. This video will demonstrate how to add a prefix to conditions using find and update in ControlM Enterprise Manager client. Here is a workspace with jobs using in and out conditions so that the jobs run in certain flow. There are times the condition names will need to be changed due to business requirement changes. The direct way is to go into each job property to change the condition names. However, if there are many jobs to be changed, it will be easier to use the find and update feature on the ContraM client for this purpose. Here is how you will do it. The top section will be to set the criteria on finding the affected jobs. Since I wanted to change all the jobs in this workspace, I will leave the default value. After setting the find jobs filter, you can click on find to list all the affected jobs before proceeding. Once the jobs are identified, add the following update statements to add a prefix to all in and out condition names. In this example, I will add a COND prefix to all condition names. Do this for both the in conditions and out conditions update statements. Proceed with update to implement the changes. The result is shown on the bottom. Review all the affected jobs to ensure the changes are as expected. If for some reasons the changes are required to be reverted, there is a rollback updates option on the find and update interface for this purpose. You can see the condition names are reversed to the original values after the rollback. To proceed with the change again, simply click on update with the same filter to update all the jobs. Remember to check in the workspace to update the job definition stored in the database for the changes to take effect. That concludes this Contram solution video. Please see our knowledge base and YouTube channel for more videos like this.